We're on the cusp of a colossal occasion. A semi-final encounter here at the Euros. And the nerves must surely be jangling. Who will come out on top? This is EA TV. Hello, great to have the pleasure of your company and welcome to our coverage of this semi-final here at the 2024 UEFA European Championship. My name is Derek Ray here on the commentary position and sitting next to me providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson keen anticipation ahead of this colossal encounter it's germany against denmark well what a match up between these two excellent and it might be and a goal the opening statement in this semi-final how important could that prove to be well this is a brilliant strike as you can see he hits it with so much power the keeper had no chance fantastic finish So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1 0. Havertz. And Kai Havertz. Denmark have it back now. Vestergaard on to Anderson Schulmann Havertz and it's with Mittelstedt well nicely cut out now what can they do with the ball can he find the right pass Interception to snuff out the danger. Good ball over the top. Decent position for Germany to be in, but they dealt with the threat posed. Christian Eriksen now. Well, ball back with Germany now. Pabier. And Hoybier with it. Fluency of movement. But then the commentator's curse comes into play. Nice looking pass. Well, I thought that would be a goal, but what a save. Great reactions. Horse with the corner, and just over the bar. Well, he attacked it so well, but he just couldn't get above it, could he? Pretty tidy looking attack, continued by Ericsson. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Hoybier. Morten Hulman. And Hoybier with it. Vestergaard. Christensen, Hoybier, Hoybier, 
Just the challenge that was required. Well, the referee trying to play advantage there, but it wasn't forthcoming. Well, the goalkeeper doing what he's paid to do. Ground to make up, and perhaps this corner can assist them. Well, the header needed to be a lot better than that. Didn't really make the keeper work. Beards. Kai Havertz. And a textbook interception. And they could really get at the opposition. And let's give credit to the defending. Could be productive, and that's a corner. And over from Ericsson, and efficient defending. Jamal Musiala, and he's lost custody of the ball here. This could be the equaliser. And the goal won't stand. Offside the decision. Well, that was always going to be brought back. It was a decent effort, though. Jamal Musiala. Andri. Musiala. And the flag has gone up. Offside. Gundogan. Well, a successful intervention, winning the ball back. Rebier. Jonas Witt. Well, there's a really stylish piece of running. A well, fine reading of the situation. And they're trying to get right into his face. Gundogan. Gundogan threading it through. In it goes! It just gets better and better for them. Another goal, and they can truly dream of the final now. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And what a strike by Havertz. That really is a clinical finish. There was no stopping that. The ball is moving again. 2-0 is how it stands. Rebier. And a chance to whip it in here. Oh, he squandered the chance, and he knows it. Well, it wouldn't have counted anyway. He was offside, but nonetheless, that was a poor attempt. Musiala and the referee sensibly allowing them to carry on advantage with them Kai Havertz and possession lost intercepted promising from Ericsson There to win it back. Beards. Maximilian Mittelstedt. Now with Havertz. Germany pushing forward with options available. And slipped through by Ilkay Gundogan. Oh, so near. Off the post. Well, they can bring it out now. And take it away. He won the ball. Options in the centre. 
Will he shoot? The fans hope so. Can he put it in? Oh, great block. Gundogan. Kimmich. Havertz. Really fine feet. Well, it was a promising avenue of attack, but the momentum has been halted. And you wouldn't be surprised to see the card handed out. And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, and it certainly deserved a yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. Well, the post getting in the way there. Well, they survived the attack. And with that, the first half draws to a close. And the ball moving once again. The pendulum having already swung Germany's way. Will we see more dazzling football from them in this second half? Christensen. Here's Anderson. Good looking pass. And Denmark struggling to keep it. Intense pressure. Eriksson. Nicely timed tackle. Musiala. And the referee spotted the foul, but has played advantage. Very quick thinking there. What was the chance they could get caught out on the break here? Well, they couldn't quite use that break in the manner that they'd hoped. Maximilian Mittelstedt. It's with Gundogan. Good move in the making from Germany, but they took care of the situation defensively. Distributing it well. Wirtz. No high quality defending. Schulman, Hoylund. How can he take them on and beat them? No possibilities inside the box. Eriksson. Textbook defending inside the box. Andri. Gundogan. Kai Havertz. Wirtz. This is Kroos. Not a good tackle. Using his physical strength to shield it. And into the last 30 minutes now. And he loves drifting in off the flank. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Kai Havertz. Havertz. Oh, great attacking play. Oh, could be. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Out of play it goes, and it will be a throw-in. They decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Oh, genuine chance. Attempting to place the ball in the back of the net, but not going according to plan.
Well, credit to him for the challenge and a throw in conceded. Vestergaard. Bar. A delicious piece of skill. Will it happen for him here? And a decent save. Full credit. Andri. Kai Havertz. And quick thinking defensively. Rasmus Hoilun. Now he must favour the cross. And that is how to block. And he's knocked it out of play, so a throw-in is the decision. Well, as those stats tell us, Germany have been second best in terms of possession, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think it's been a really good performance from them so far. And the threat on the counter-attack is very real. Here they come again. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. And it's opening up. And the post getting in the way. And eventually into the grateful grasp of the keeper. Well, that could have gone anywhere once it hit the woodwork, but they've got away with it here. Pabier. And good use of advantage. The referee allowing play to continue. Well, he was very keen to give them the advantage, but instead it will be a free kick now. He succeeds in clearing it. Jamal Musiala. And an astute piece of defending. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Defenders need to cover. Kimi. Here's Havertz. What's he going to do here? Muda. Opportunity. Well, what a stop it was. Well, I have to say, that's a magnificent save. That's a top-class piece of goalkeeping. Schulman. Alexander Bach. And Germany recovering possession well. Müller. He's in behind. And a goal to settle the issue once and for all. Well, first of all, where's the defending? They're all over the place. But give him some credit. That's a good finish. Great composure. Vestergaard on to Anderson. And Hoybier with it. Can he finish? And a fantastic diving save. And time for the change now. Corner kick taken by Christian Eriksen. And taking care of the situation. Nicely blocked by Kors. Musiala. Germany doing well to regain possession. Müller. And threading it through. Just needs to stay calm. And there is the goal to make it a hat-trick. Excellence in finish. 
watching, there for all to see. Well, that's a clinical finish. He just put his head down and smashed it past the keeper. There was no stopping that, was there? A lopsided contest, 4-0. Jonas Vint. Very quick thinking there. Well, totaling up all the stoppages, we'll have two additional minutes. Nico Schlotterbeck. Florian Wirtz. Now with Havertz. Kai Havertz. Kimi. And back with Havertz. And there it is, the full-time whistle. The host nation have done it. Germany through to the final of the Euros. Well, it was such a dominant performance from start to finish. They dictated the tempo for large parts of the game and were absolutely lethal in front of goal. After a performance like that, they have to be favourites going into that final now. Surely it's theirs to lose.